guys welcome back again to Smex is Mix from the next session TV. Remember, I give you all the updates. I talk about the labor law, I talk about the jobs, I talk about the opportunity, and I'll still give you that advice that is going to make you more in one way or the other. In today's video, I want me to, to I want to talk about uh, a small thing that people definitely people take it lightly, but people ask me a lot of questions about what you call housekeeping, housekeeping itself. Remember, that is something that people underestimate. That is a career, that is a small path for what you call the unskilled jobs, especially for people who are coming in the Gulf countries or are coming in the Gulf countries that people to understand. What am I talking about? I'm talking about what you call cleaning, housekeeping. It may be cleaning in the commercial sector. It may be housekeeping in what you call an hospitality sector. It might be in the restaurant, it might be in the restaurant and a hotel. It must be housekeeping in what you call commercial building or what we call residential building. It's all about housekeeping will definitely require a lot, will definitely teach you a lot of skills that people do not know. We are looking at cleaning, making the work done, learning a bit of the techniques. It is where you can move very faster from one career to another. Most of the people come here, they have their education paper. You do have those academic paper. But it gets very a little bit very hard for you to pour through what, what we call the professional level. For example, you came here as an engineer. Most of the people coming from Africa, you have those bachelor's degree in what you call engineering or even uh, uh, anything. But it may be very hard for you without too much Gulf experience to pour through, to through what you call the system. But it's, everything goes by what you call a step, step by step. What am I trying to say? It is also another place that, uh, another career that I've definitely identified and that is what was called housekeeping. You can move very fast up to the ladder, which you may not even expect yourself at one way or the other. Because first of all, you learn a lot of skills. And when you get to learning your skills, you may start as a housekeeper in a hospitality sector. Let's say, for example, this is a hotel where you're a housekeeper. The next day tomorrow, they will be looking for what you call a team leader. Your behavior, your attitude, and how you be, or how you mingle out, or how you definitely get to to work with a team, teammate, uh, teammates, and how you work with a team, you become a team leader the next day. And how about being a team leader? They will say, okay, fine now. Internally, remember in some companies there are what you call recruitments, internal recruitments. They always want to recruit from the same people they have. They will be looking for what you call a supervisor. Remember, for looking at a supervisor role, they will look at a person with the skills, they look at a person with the experience in the same sector. This is, a place, this, is, this is a time that you have that opportunity now. You've been in that company, you have the skills, you have the experience, and they will say, we need someone who has a paper, who has what you call an academic uh, document that is going to support what he's going to do. This is where the chance comes in. You present yourself. They'll definitely not even have to ask you a lot of questions because they know you know the procedures, you know the procedures in that place, and you know what it's all about to do what you call housekeeping. This is where you are rising from what you call a mere housekeeper to a team leader, to a supervisor, and to an assistant manager. All right? So after moving out into that ladder, remember it's not all about getting the skills, but it's even getting what you call, you learning what you call the administration part of it. From there, who knows? You become the next manager of the housekeeping department. And out of that, if you're so much interested into the career, you can go up for some small course. You can have some bit of small course. And after that course coming in, you add on what you have, a small certificate, uh, ascertained, then the next day you'll be a hotel manager. This is how you can build your career. Unlike in other sectors, when you talk about security, it's a little bit very hard. When you talk about construction, it may be a little bit very hard and it may take a given duration of time for you to do. And still, if you don't have even the paper, it may take you a little bit harder, which is not what you call the housekeeping. So people who are coming into these Gulf countries, for example, if you are coming in Qatar or you are coming in anywhere in the Gulf countries, please try out the housekeeping. Don't mind about the way it starts. The start is always very hard. 
but it's out of being hard. You work smart, you learn, then at the end of it all you'll achieve. Hope I've tried to share something for you. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. Remember, it's always makes from the next question, giving on the artist, giving you everything that you've done. By the way, if it's your first time to come across this channel, please consider supporting and subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to click uh, the bell icon. Don't forget to support. Don't forget to share. I will always be more than happy to get back to you. See you again in the next video as we talk about most of these important things that we need to share for our career growth and development. Thank you so much. See you again in the next video.